So the rope ladder is a really useful device for solving problems, the sort of things that can easily happen to any climber, particularly on committing climbs like traverses, uh, sea cliffs, uh, places where it's difficult to retreat. Uh, and the best way, if you find yourself hanging in space like I am here, will be to climb up the rope. So that's what I'm going to show you how to do now. So my first task is to create some slack in the rope by placing a rope man and clipping myself to it. So let's get a rope man. There we go. Rope man one. Pop that onto the rope. And if I was worried about dropping it, I could put a leash on. Let's get a carabiner. And pop that in there. There we go. Right, now I want a foot loop. So I'm going to get this long sling and clip it in up there. There we go. And I'll just wrap that around my foot, make things slightly easier for stepping up. And then slide that up. Next job is to get a quick draw, ordinary quick draw, clip this into my harness and my mission is to clip this quick draw into that top carabiner. So I want this nice and high because I want to create lots of slack. And then this is quite strenuous but it's just one quick pull and clip in. So here we go, pull up, you see the slack appearing in the rope, lovely. And there we go, I've got a nice load of slack now. I'm hanging comfortably, I'm no longer hanging on the, the end of the rope, I'm hanging on there. So I'm hanging very comfortably now, slacking the rope, I'm hanging off this and it feels cool. Next job is to get another rope man. I'm going to pop this onto the slack piece of rope. There we go, clip in there, get a screw head carabiner. And we're going to just slide this down until I can clip it into my harness, like so. And this is where now having some slack rope becomes useful because I'm going to pull upwards. So just get my hand here, pull up, and I'm now climbing the rope. Let's watch this again, just move my foot up. In fact, let's get rid of the quick draw and I can step up more easily. So slide that up and then I'm going to pull up on this and it gives me a mechanical advantage. It's quite easy to pull this up and then the rope man locks in place. If for some reason you need to go down again, then it is possible to reverse this. All we need to do is use these tails so we'll slide this leg down a little bit and then slide this down the rope and then I'll let it lock off. Bring this down a little bit, like so, and then I'm going to use this to slide down. There we go. A bit at a time. So there you go, we've shown you how you can use a couple of rope men to climb up a rope very easily and eff effectively. Uh, and the rope men makes the job much easier. So it's a good reason to carry a couple of these on your harness, particularly when you're going to committing places like sea cliffs and multi-pitch climbs.